Hey, cousins. Hey, it's your girl, Mary Kay, coming to you with a slay today. Hey, hey. Coming to you with a few slays today. Let the church say subscribe. What's going on, y'all? What's going on? Today, I'm bringing you a comparison video. A while back, I did a video featuring... Yes, girl. Yes. 10-inch light yakky bob. The people were impressed, okay? I've also gotten other questions about their other bob variations like they have 12 inch they have 14 inch and then they have one without a bang and it's like a c part so what i did was for the cousins i got all low so you can see it all in one video i already know these wigs about to slap it's looking good on the mannequin i'm hoping that it's gonna show up for your girl because everything that looks good on the mannequin now that don't necessarily me okay 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 Alrighty, guys so if you remember this is the 10 inch bang light yakky wig that i have already reviewed so i didn't have to do much to this wig you guys i have not pressed this wig bumped this wig anything since the last video that i did and i've worn this wig several times you hear me literally this wig is the bomb okay this wig is one of my favorites hands down this is a throw on and go the movement is still there the density is still there she's still banging so that's the 10 inch okay now we're going to open up these new ones we're going to start with the 12 inch so this is what came in the box i purchased these myself you guys this is not a sponsored video um i'm just i'm doing this for, for the cousins okay the inside the cap construction is the exact same as the 10 inch so what i'm going to do is literally the exact same thing that i did on the initial video i'm gonna just bump it have a few passes through you know get a little bit of that shape together and then comb through it and y'all i promise you that's it that is all you have to do. I would suggest giving it a little bump once you take it out the package because you know in shipping it has you know it gets lumpy and bumpy and, and crusty and all kind of stuff just because of the shipping. So it takes the form of the bag that it's in and all that stuff. So I just like to do this but y'all when I tell you this light yakky is the bomb it holds these bumps. You're not going to have to do this every single time you wear this wig y'all for real literally so this is the exact same that 180 percent density is there they ain't lying you can trim the bangs if you want to this is the 14 inch you guys i did the exact same thing i'm literally just showing you the difference between lengths but baby do y'all see that that light yakky is a vibe the movement it's like a natural press and i love that again trim the bangs if you like them a little bit shorter i love the length of these bangs um just for the look of it i wouldn't drive with these bangs in my face <laughs> but i love for the look of it y'all absolutely love it so that's the 14 inches as you can see it's got all the flow it's got all the density as the 10 and the 12 it's just longer so it just depends on what you're looking for last but not least this is the c part now because there's lace attached to this and there's a closure we got to do a little bit more work with this one okay because there are no bangs to cover up the front now i'm going to do some plucking very light plucking it was pre-plucked but it was pre-plucked just enough to get you started okay you have to be careful with this one though because the tracks like the actual cap starts very close to the front of the wig so there's only a little bit of hair in the front to actually pluck and you don't want to over pluck okay so that's why i did it this way and i'm kind of coming at the back of the little section because behind that is track hair all right so I'm doing slight plucking now here this part you don't have to do it's already the part is already there I just like being ignorant on top of ignorant sometimes okay y'all already know what time it is y'all not new to this y'all true to this so I am deepening that C curve okay again you don't have to do it and for my cousins who can't stand baby hair there will be no swooper dupes okay i'm gonna show you what this looks like with not now swooper dupe i got you but look at that volume y'all i ain't y'all they this this i don't need to get my bobs from anywhere else i'm telling you like it's it's over with what else do i need in a bob i i, I can't 
don't know, y'all. I don't know. But you just throw that on. After you do that, I just define the part. You don't have to do that, you guys. But bam, it is a glueless wig. Y'all. <laughs> oh my gosh. Their bobs are off the hook. I cannot lie. Their bobs are so easy to work with. But this has been just a very short comparison video so that when you are shopping, you can see for yourself what these will look like in length. The densities are consistent. Their pictures on their website, super consistent, you guys. It is what it is. What you see is what you get. Make sure you check them out. Um, the links are in the description box, y'all. Do your thing thing. This was just me showing you, bam, on a human head, <laughs> what these different wigs look like, all right? Let me know in the comments which one you're feeling the most. Let me know. All right, peace, love, light.